What's more important, power or talk? We call it area under the graph. Now what that means is if you've got a power line that is going up to 200, 300 kilowatts and you've got a torque line that's you know, 500 newton meters of torque, if you can get that area under that graph higher, then you've increased in power. Now what that means is if I can bring that torque line up from 500 to 600 newton meters and not increase in power, that car is gonna feel like a different car on the road. So in my eyes, I believe torque is more important than power. You do have people out there that like to have see the number, and they like to see the big figures. That's good, that's great, but to drive them at that top end at 8,000 RPM wide open throttle, the car's never gonna get there on the road. So torque is, a, is a more applicable to 99% of people on the road. On a racetrack, torque is also very important too because when you're going into a corner and out of a corner, torque is the thing that actually gives you the pull. So it's gonna pull you out of the corners faster. So you're asking me what's more important, power or torque? I would say to you, torque would be more important than power. Right? Having said that, you can't have a power figure without torque figures. So if you increase in torque, you should definitely increase in power in some areas.